Okay, time for another terrible game made in one hour. Um, just to review the rules, everything in the game has to be made entirely within the one hour, the exception of that being free assets like um, sprites or sounds or something that I find online for free, but still within the hour. Um, once the hour's done, we stop and see where we're at. <clears throat> so, um, let's get started. So, what I'm trying to build for this is, um, I'll just start with the description now, because I know. What we're trying to build for this is a very stupid idea for a game. Um, where... Um, sorry. Okay, cool. Basically, we're going to have monsters that approach the player. Um, and when they, as they approach, they're, they're going to have little boxes above them with a random string of, well, not a random string of letters, but um, with some letters jumbled up and the player just has to work out what that nonsense is an anagram of uh, let's go 400 by 400 we're just making a little monster that's that's it that's the whole thing um, like outline the paintbrush. Uh, maybe that's a bit flat. Um, little, little legs. You can see why I uh, don't normally create my own assets. That's not horn like at all. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, there we go. And then we're going to color him in, um, I guess, like a sort of dark red. Um, oh, we've, we've, there's a bit of a gap there. Put you that way. Anywhere else? Yeah, it's probably good. Hmm, weird. There we go. Um, I think that's, that's too much. Yeah, that will do. Um, and then we'll go a little bit lighter for the head. Wow, that's really bad. And let's even try to get some sensible colouring for the horns. Yeah, that'll do. Right, now we'll go like this here, wrap it around the other thing from the areas. This assets, and it's not going to be monster.png. There we go. We have a little monster we can drop in. Look at that. Look at him. He's adorable. Um, okay, so uh, we got the monster. We got that. Um, we need, we got a list of strings. Yeah which I'm going to just, um, yeah, I'm just going to make the list of strings uh, on here. So we're going to have a three and two, uh, control, control, rather, which goes right at the top. That's one of them. 
I'm just going to stick three words in after this. So we're going to have, let's go with four words, four letter words. So we'll have dove, uh, we'll have cream, and we'll have uh, ouch. There we go. Those are the three letters. Now, um, monster needs some text attached to it. Um, and this is word. Now, um, the monster currently does not get any text. I need to import the essentials, that's why. Ooh, right, so, um, canvas is world space. With that, nope, with that as the camera. Ah, Jesus Christ. M100. That doesn't really have an effect, does it? Oh, well. Uh, how do I scale the show on here? Just to check. Yeah, okay, it does follow. Um, but. Hmm. I see that doesn't seem to change anything. So I guess we'll just bring the scale down. There we go. But not point not one. Not point not one. No, not point not one. There we go. See that's a reasonable amount. Um and we're gonna bring that just to here. Probably make it a bit bigger. Okay, and then the central. Make it bold. Uh, let's make it even bigger. Um, so that's roughly what the word will look like. Uh, but we'll have um, NFUS. Okay, well, it needs to be a little bit wider than that. There we go. 225. Infus. It does need to be slightly higher. So it's going to get that. Uh, we're going to put. Uh, oh, we've already got our canvas behind them. Gonna, oh no, we were going to put a doo -ba -doo -ba -doo. Just a little panel. I wonder what it's going to be on top of. The word's going to be next to, um, but most of all, if we make this all the way, no, we want it, um, what's this position in line? There we go. And then we're going to make it just a little bit wider. So we need the canvas just a little bit higher. To the left it looks a bit more central, even if it isn't. Um, that'll do. Right. Um, right, now the monster needs its own control script. So monster no no spaces because it doesn't like that we're going to leave it here and we're going to throw that on here so um excuse me i wanted to open up the monster behavior thank you and uh, now the first thing it's going to need is access to that um text so uh, TMP text and is text. Um, quick. 
I just to make sure. Uh, so um, it's also going to have just going to hold a reference to the um, single to the game controller. Um, game controller PC. The start. I'm going to give it the PC equals game controller. There we go. Cool. Um, Let's see, what are we going to have? We're going to have the moving... We'll have the monster move across the screen towards you. Or down the screen? Yeah, across the screen. So we're going to give them speed. Nope. Um, and like float and... Speed. That's it. And um, fixed update. And we're going to so line from the past. <laughs> Move. Um, and then we're just going to say and transform dot position plus equals. And the three um, speed times delta time row F. There we go. So actually, wait, no, we wanted to do one other thing uh, on start. We also wanted to um, have. Hey, there we go. I get component in children, just in case. Cool. Um, what's the behavior? We're going to make his speed one. And let's check that works. Yay. Cool. Right. Now he needs to get. Um, he needs to be able to get the words, um, public string, get, and uh, get word. Um, and it's, um, oops, maybe equals random dot range um zero and words dot count and then return words i nice and straightforward um I have a public string word and anagram. I wanted to keep track of what the correct word is. Um, so we're going to have void scramble, uh, which for now is just going to. Um, uh, we're gonna have uh, we're gonna create <laughs> uh, um equals zero one two three Right now we'll have um, two, zero, three, one. There we go. Uh, and then it will be um, anagram equals 
uh, word uh, ship um, word i zero plus Um, shit, how would we do this? There we go, I worked it out. One, two, three, cool. So, um, it's gonna be gc dot, um, get word. Word equals, um, and, um, Yes, that should return a string. Should have been a oh. There we go. Um, cool. Uh, and once we've done that, then uh, we take text and that equals anagram. Okay, right. Now we're 20 minutes in. We should be further along. Let's think in. Right. Um, It gets references to that itself, and these are done so, in theory. Okay. Meet this in a wake. You should be able to do that in a wake. Because that's the problem there. Okay, it just says 411. That ain't right. <laughs> Cream. <laughs> what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> what am I doing stupid? So, right. A plus equals word zero. Right? That should just be a character, right? <laughs> Is this a stupid way of doing this? Yes, it's a stupid way, but hey. D four. Okay, so that's that's good. So why does it give numbers? <laughs> Okay, what if R E I uh wait J N I Reach 
Okay. I have a plus a that's equals um, word j. Maybe that'll work. Yay, it does. Right, cool. Right, now we need uh, the the thing that lets you type it. So, right, we need... Um, input field. Yay. Um, let's do that real quick. We need... A new canvas. Um, screen space. Okay, there we go. Cool. Um, and this is going to have an input field. Now, how the fuck? This is character limit is going to be four, right? So okay, cool, right. Um, all right, I'm going to bring this uh, up to here. Well, maybe not quite that far up. And we'll bring it low. Let's make it fucking huge. Okay, so this is going to be, I don't know, 40. Well, this is going to be really important, actually. So let's make it 80. So it needs to be even bigger. And let's make the... Uh, why is this so different? Content window, I don't know. Ooh. I didn't know I had that. That's going to be really helpful. Can I... Cool. Gonna say what? Okay, so um we then need game controller. Uh it's gonna be public void make yes. Uh, it's also going to have a a list of uh, monsters. Okay, so for each um, monster in monsters, 
Monster behavior. Oh, and that needs to be a string. Yes. Um, if yes is the same as nb dot word nb dot die kill that's not a public method so And we'll go into the guesses. We have on end edit. Uh, in controller. Um, make guess. And then we will start the game controller. this and also that just in case so i think what should happen here is if i type in dove oh beautiful right cool well i mean that's the key mechanics um so let's um Update, uh, we'll do spawn, sorry, void spawn booster, and uh, we'll have a enemies, not enemies, enemies, um, and then. If uh, uh, monsters dot count is less than max enemies, uh, then she is monster. Um, uh, Vector three is position, so vector three is going to be like minus ten, zero, zero, and turn down identity. Um. Right, and then the monster deals with that itself, doesn't it? Yeah. Keep going to that. Um, all right, let's go to this monster. We put it at minus 10. And zero. Okay, we'll make it minus 11. Damn it. <laughs> All right, monster is now prefab. I'm going to delete that one. And game controller gets. Excuse me, gets, gets. Why is it not liking? There we go. I think I might have been pulling the wrong one. Uh, max enemies. It's going to spawn them all at once. Um, so we'll start with one and I will work out what to do later. So. It should spawn them in. And it doesn't. Why not? Did I just not call it ever? I didn't call it. Typical. 
I swear this used to be faster at recompiling shit. Alright, we're about halfway. Oh my god. I didn't add it to the count. Okay. Um, and then we go... Um, monsters... Dot add... Go. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm so good at this. Hey, I never promised quality. In fact, I promised the opposite. Right, okay, so that's dove. Wait, shit, I'm not focused on it. Uh, dove. When they die, it doesn't reduce the shit. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. That shouldn't happen. I shouldn't have to do this, but hey. Hey, do you know what? Um, uh, dark monsters. Remove game object. Is that good object oriented programming? No, they're entangled as shit now. Um, can I be bothered to fix it? No, because I've got 29 minutes to finish the rest of this. Um, what is that? So that's going to be cream. What? Oh no, cream is too long! <laughs> I'm such a dumbass. Um, uh, fire, there we go. That's a four-letter word. <laughs> I'm so good at this. Uh, so, fire. Um, dove. We're going to just hit dove again until we get something else. Fire, there we go. Okay, we might need the monsters to be a bit faster. Let's, get, let's double their speed. Uh, okay, cool. Now, let's make a little player. Um, you know, we're also going to make him a little 400 by 400 little guy. Uh, he's he's going to have... Um, what's the player going to look like? Uh, it doesn't really matter. Shit. Uh, just give him some legs. A little gingerbread man. Um, and we're gonna have... We're gonna give him a little dictionary. How's about that? Oh, oh. Get a little, uh, and then let's make it, I don't know, fucking dark green, I guess. Why am I spending so much time on drawing a book? No, that's good. I don't need to spend any more time drawing this book. Alright, back to the fat little boy. Is that what we were on? Yeah, that's good enough. Um, so he's just going to be like holding this. Oh god, I'm so bad. Um, fuck it. Yeah, that's that's what an arm looks like. He's going to be like waving his other hand in the air because he's doing like magic or something. This guy's going to get a bit of a neck.
and a wizard hat, because I've decided it's a wizard killing monsters with letters. Um, why? Uh, because fuck you, that's why. We're gonna give him a purple hat. Um, and it's gonna have some like purpley blue sparks coming out of here. And then, I don't know, we'll just give him, uh, we'll make him grey, like, you know, race neutral. Maybe give him a little bit of a rogue. The weird cut off rogue. Um, Oh god, I'm wasting so much time. It's gonna be funny though. I'm gonna give, give him some little stars. Nope, not the Star of David. That is too dicey. Oh, we're just gonna give him some little crosses then. This does not look like a wizard robe. It looks like some kind of uh, terrible. Like a moo moo type thing, but oh well. Um, this is this is what the player looks like. Bam! Canonically, this is the player. He sort of looks like he's levitating as well, which is very funny to me. Um, um, player behavior. This is gonna be real simple. And then I don't know what it's going to do yet. Okay. Um, right. Monster doesn't have a collider attached to it. Um, so we want to give it a rigid body. With no gravity. Nope. No, that's the opposite of no gravity. That's, well, it's not the opposite. I mean, yeah, it is. It's, it's lots of gravity. Box collider. Box collider? Yeah, sure. Box collider. Let's stick a monster in and make sure that's all kosher. Um, let's make the box a little bit smaller. All right, we'll go uh, there. Um, actually, let's make it even smaller. Right, yeah, it's only the front of it that matters. We can get a hand onto the wizard. Um, box collider. And rigid body also no and also to be honest let's uh let's make that box collider a lot smaller and offset it over here. yeah that'll do cool um apply that first of all wizard let's also give you player behavior Um, lives. We'll call that health. Um, just gonna get rid of that. Um, and then we're gonna go, um, right on collision into 2D. Uh, there's only one other thing it's gonna collide with, so it's just gonna be, um, health minus minus christ very exciting um and then we're gonna bring update back uh if health is zero i'm gonna go with less than or equal to zero just in case 
Um, you dying. Say that up here he's got um. Public void end game. And score. There we go. And then we also have um no. That won't be. Is this terrible? Yes. Please, your. Wow, I really should not have put this on the monster. Um. T dot. Great. I'm so good at um, spelling. <laughs> Okay, so I've just noticed that uh, about 48 minutes in, I tried to rename a variable and that turned the recording off. So apologies. Um, I didn't notice that. So here's what we've got. Uh, it, it took it took pretty much an hour. Um, and this is the situation we ended up in. Um, so we can kill enemies. And then they come in, and eventually they reach you, and kill you, and you can even restart now, so that's a new feature. Um, apologies about that. Um, what are you going to do?